I am Madi Salem. Uh, I work for Alliance Ashira as project coordinator based in Ashira, Ethiopia, uh, Tigray. Uh, I'm just working for ZOA as an implementing partner uh, for the partnership. Uh, just have been uh, working for uh, different uh, organizations before. Uh, what uh, I know is just uh, many times uh, partners or humanitarian organizations uh, do not uh, think of about the sustainability, uh, what's happening after the support or intervention is given. Uh, but here, like in Alianza Ashura, just the main pillar for the project is the sustainability issue. Having different partners with different experience, with different expertise uh, around a specific project uh, makes uh, or helps to uh, quality programming uh, and even uh, makes or uh, to, um, helps to share experiences, expertises from which even many organizations can learn and uh, take lessons in their uh, intervention, especially in the humanitarian, in the humanitarian intervention. And as far as the partnership is extended with several partners, or with the several organizations, uh, there may be uh, communication problems, uh, coordination problems because of uh, their, because uh, things are dependent on uh, the commitments of this organization or people. Uh, an implementing partner has to uh, coordinate and uh, develop coordination platforms with humanitarian organizations there in the operation. Uh, create linkages with governmental and local NGOs uh, in the sector. Uh, an implementing partner uh, need to, has to uh, just work in partnership with the community since the community, the, the target community need to be uh, the foremost uh, partner for the project. Uh, the, community, the, the targeted community, both the host community and the refugees are our main partners. We had conducted frequent uh, assessment is uh, like uh, surveys how to know how the people or the community is willing toward this or the interest or the reflection of the to know the reflection of the community toward this Alianza project especially on the off-grid project as far as it is very new community participatory uh, mapping was conducted uh, in, order, in order to uh, participate or to know, to get the views of the uh, refugee population where we were just um, designing the technical uh, design for the uh, street lighting in each camp and so that just the people could tell us the prioritized areas where uh, we, need to, uh, uh, we need to provide street lighting. So far, uh, I believe that uh, the, the target community is just participating in the project. Uh, but what I see is here is just uh, the project's uh, scope is very, limi very limited. For example, for the off-grid uh, component, uh, around 300 beneficiaries are uh, going to be benefited from uh, per each camp and even for, uh, from the on-grid project. Only 130 business are, are going to be connected to the to, to the grid. So the scope is too limited relative to the, the demand. So I have a concern that later uh, the people may just complain if the participation of uh, the, the committee is not intensive. Yes, they may complain on Alianza project later, which is against the reputation of Alianza Shira project. It's coordinating uh, several uh, organizations may not be easy, but as a facilitator, uh, the facilitator need to uh, set a clear communication, which is communication channel with the organizations. Uh, need to identify um, the expertise of the different organizations just to bring around uh, the specific project and even need to identify the limitations of the implementing partner. And here, for example, in, the, in, the pro in this project, just different types of analysis, surveys, and assessments are being conducted. So uh, the, these uh, assessments and this, the documents or data need to be a com compiled and a kind of data will need to be, uh, kind of data will need to be formed so then later uh, anyone uh, can refer and or um, kind of uh, good things or good lessons can be published, which, which can be 
uh, share to the international community, to donors and the like, just to promote the project or other similar projects.